Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome! Welcome, happy Wednesday, my dudes! Happy Wednesday, everybody. I lied about fixing V Bridger, by the way, so we're not gonna use it again today. I thought I fixed it and then it got unfixed. Hi, everybody! This is. Your dream is <laughs> by Mama Amia Aranya. And, um, I don't know why I got so excited about the your part, but, um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, sorry, that was really aggressive. I apologize. <laughs> I apologize. Hello, everybody. Hi, hi, hi. Good to see you guys. Um, I... Your... Hold on. Water. I went to get water and then I didn't even go open it. Yeah. Ah, delicious. Hello, you guys. Happy hump day. Happy hump day. Good to see you guys. Hope you guys are having a good week so far. Um, 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 um. Yeah, I had a lot of technical stuff to try and take care of right before the stream started. First, my analog clock. It's the week of technical, technical issues. Saying you're like you're looking directly into the face of a buckle you caught, calling someone else an Oshi. <gasps> <laughs> Cleaning broken glass out of the bathtub drain. Wait, what happened? How did you get broken glass in your bathtub drain? Were you having a were you having a little bath a little glass of wine? And then at the end of the bath you emptied out all the water and then you you were a little bit too drunk with your glass of wine and then you went and it all broke. In your bathtub. Is that what happened? I'm gonna choose to believe that that's what happened. Anyway, hi everyone. Let me say hi to everyone. Meow. Meow. Wow. Hello to uh, Shrike and Gildrian and Doiro and DJ and Jamal and Hart and Inzaizar. Hello to Jeweler and Wilson and Turbo and Star Pop and Finite Set. Hello to K7 and Mal no Mal. Hello Peppermint and Muffy and Marv and FC and Planum and AX and Fish and Koala Slime and Sumptuous Potato. Um, Ohamia to Josh and Goldheart Dragon and Railgun. Only my Railgun cash. <laughs> Uh, hello Gento and Hero. Hello to Punt Storm and Big Guy and JD Assassin and hello Lurkers and Vod Watchers as well. Hello Noah and hello Golden Slaughter and Luminous Wings and Iron Stag. Hello Hussar and Dylan and Akatsuki. Hello to Handsome Orc and Zabolis. Good afternoon to you as well, Tasty Snacks. Oh, you're a fish. You are a tasty snack. Um, uh, hello, Zabalisk and Cat Bus and Liquid Cat and Taman. Hello to Megu and Jellyhead and Johan and Batsu. Uh, and Ohamia to Aetyan and Temporal Paradox. YouTube added numbers onto you and you ended up losing your... Oh, is that why? I've been seeing, like... Whenever people... Whenever people give me, like, comments on YouTube or whatever, I look at my notifications, it says at... And then it has some name I don't recognize. So I, like, don't recognize you guys when you're commenting on my stuff anymore. Unless it happens to be the same as your name. It's very strange. Uh, hello, Rhea. Hello, uh, Super Condor. And Phoenix and Shook their House and Indecisive. Yeah, it's weird, right? Can you change it back? You guys should change yours. Because then I'll, I, I, all I, the only way I can tell is your profile pictures. <laughs> Neil! Neil! Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to... To, you know. How sad. Um, hello, Eki and Dark and Local Man and Riding Soul and Miller. And Mega Blender. Uh, and hello to Koshi and Kirby and Mr. Front and Kayla and Tamascus. Um, hello Big Simp. Hello to Pyri and Iskander. Yeah, why why did every platform all at once decide to take such an inane, like asinine method for just like let's give everyone new usernames? Why not? Like why? Why? Uh, hello Crimson Tapples and Illinois Roy and No Fun Zone and Bubon and Buckwheat. Hello to Yonju Nana. Good luck on your test. Yatta yatta. Well, not yatta, but you know. Good luck on your test. It'll be yatta when you're finished. Uh, hello Bran. Hello. Uh, Mab and Fanology. Anyone with Japanese usernames gets randomly generated garb. No! No. I think I got to pick mine. It's very stupid. I was surprised I was I was able to change my Discord one already because I like just made my Discord like 
year and a half ago. Uh, hi, Implode and Movic and Brielle and Smashes and Rocketo Kato and Sturm and Pity Burger and Juice and hello to Nintendo Fan and Amtrak Man and Silho and Maxter and Guile and hello to Neo Blackguard and Kinetic and Blau and hello to Iju and Engak and Sarah De Pixel uh, and Riley and DJ Gamer. Nitro factors into it. <laughs> I spit on nitro <laughs> even though I have it, but I have like the very basic one. Um, um, hello, bike. Hello, sweet wooble. Hello to Necrozma and Zircon and P Taco. Hello to Dread Excalibur and Within the Nice. Hello, Nugget and Adam Boy and Oz Taco and Paladin Josh and Hiders. And uh, Cryocyte, hello to Rabbit Bunny Man, and Psycho No Fusion, and Boron, and hello to Esprise, uh, hello. Uh, Chester and Tomo. I do speak Japanese, I do. Uh, hello, Lole, and Flash Tirade, and almost there, almost there. Hello, Nightbot. Uh, hi, John Zero. Hi, Zill. Hello, CR Angels. Hello to Tasty Snacks and Taro. And, uh, oh, we got a, we got another Psycho, but I can't read the rest. I'll just call you. Just tell me what you want me to call you. <laughs> it's like the one episode of Seinfeld where, he, where Kramer pretends to be the movie hotline. Uh, why don't you tell me which film you would like to see? <laughs> Uh, hello, hello, Narona Fi. Hello to Reverie. And. Uh, oh, yours has an underscore. Well, that's not so bad, but it is very annoying. Um, hello, Car. Car? Seinfeld, no fusion. <laughs> different person, different person, but. Um, hello, Terragion. And hello to fogging a tin and smoker mega drive and um da -da -da, Aztec Temple and Synapse and Chicken and uh, Naznobar and JC Kun There we go. Giddy up <laughs> Okay, so the mission for today is I have the... Okay, so... So... Let's start from the beginning. You guys know when I play Game Boy games and Game Boy Advance games and stuff like that, I use something called uh, an analog pocket, which is a little device that allows you to... Um, it, it will play um, Game Boy and Game Boy Advance cartridges. You can get attachments to have it play other different kind of cartridges, like... Uh, uh, I think... Uh, Maybe Game Gear is one of them, and maybe like... What is it? Uh... There's a bunch of different ones. <laughs> like Game Gear, and then, and then, and then like, uh... Wonder Swan Color maybe is one. You can get attachments for a bunch of different other handheld, um... You know, devices. One of your amigos waited two years to get one of these. I got mine right when it first came out. It's very, very fast. Very, very fast. But I have that, um, in order. Yeah, Neo Geo Pocket, all kinds of stuff. Um, the Sega Game Gear, yeah. Uh, I thought the mission is to hug the Locos. That's like the overall mission, but we're talking about today's mission. <laughs> so, um, um, hi, Cliff. I wish I could make. Chip tune with real hardware, but I can't really make sense of trackers anyways. I just stick to VSTs. Uh, oh, for sounds you mean? Yeah, I have the, um... What's it called? Super audio cart, which I like a lot. Whatever you say is your dream movement spider mom, I imagine it in the same way as this is your daily dose of internet. No, it means that I'm yours. <laughs> um... Yeah, so I have this. And I've been using it to play games and stream them to you guys up until now because it, I, I can um, I can output HDMI, but um, it also came with a little piece of software called Nano Loop, and uh, Nano Loop is um, like a sequencing kind of software. Sequencing uh, they call it digital audio workstation. I guess it technically is, you know. Um, a da -da, and then, and then, 
That's basically it. That's basically it. So, I thought, uh, I've never tried to actually use it before, but it looks super interesting. So I thought I would use that today, since it's easy to, you know, output and to show you guys, and you guys can listen as well. Um, uh, hi, Deathwin! A dot is a dot, no matter how small. I mean, small. Good rhyme, good rhyme. <laughs> you guys will see in a minute what it looks like, I will show you guys. Um, so I have basically, I, I mean, I've looked at the manual, but... Other than that, I'm going into this blind, so we're gonna learn, hopefully, how to do it today, how to how to work it, how to use it, cause I don't know, it's always fun to to learn stuff on stream, and then I don't know if we'll be able to like make anything, but we'll see what happens. It's gonna be a fun little uh, adventure. Um, if I make a song, I'll try and make my own song, you know, something original, maybe. Um, Dread Excalibur, thank you so much for the nine months! Uh, ha happy nine buckle months, Ami. Thanks for being awesome. Keep up the great work. Your latest cover of Piano Man is amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you very, very much. I appreciate that. Nine months, so, so, such a long time. Hello, Mimi. Um, it's not... A dot is a dot. You can't say it's a half. I didn't say it's a half. Did I say it's half? No. No, you did not. <laughs> Thank you, 50 and Jagoof. Um, yeah. So, we're gonna check it out today. And I have, um, yeah, the whole manual yeah. here. It's on my other monitor. Um... So, I guess... Let's just go, and I'll show you what it looks like. Without further ado. Without further ado, the birds outside are so freaking loud today. Okay, so this is what it looks like. The interface to start. It's very, very simple. It's 4x4 four four box, you know. If I press this... This happens and you can... This is about basically as far as I got... Is figuring out how to change the like individual modes in it. Like this. You know. Uh, but that's basically all I know how to do at the moment. So... Um... Let's get rid of that. So it has a currently playing step mark in a lighter, uh, slightly darker color. Oh, that's they're talking about the manual. In this, it's lighter, and then I can just use the uh, the arrows to move around. Is red buckle on? Uh, no, it's a game, so I don't know. If you guys want to backseat, you can. I guess just <laughs> I don't know. Um. So basically, um, hi Alaska. So, so basically, uh, so, uh, apparently... <laughs> okay, so it says the current channel is displayed in the upper left corner. The current edit parameter in the upper right. So what does this mean? The current channel, what is that? The letter R? What am I looking at? Is that the letter R? Can you describe the analog pocket a bit? Are you hunched over or not? Oh no, it's outputting to my TV right now. Well, I'm gonna watch it through OBS. So, um, because it's not a game, right? Make the Resident Evil basement <laughs> theme? No, no, no. <laughs> so it's, 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 it's not a game, so I don't really have to worry about the latency being a problem. This legendary sword, dude. Wait, what? Did I? <laughs> what do you mean? Is analog pocket actually fitting in your pocket? It could probably... I don't know about my pockets because... Women's clothes don't have very good pockets. Hi, Conky! Welcome back! Women's clothes don't have very good pockets, but maybe in one of your guys' pockets it could fit. It, I mean, it's like the size of a Game Boy. Like an OG Game Boy. Uh, the current edit parameter in the upper right. So right now I guess I'm editing the music notes. Is the idea. Um... I don't think it could fit in my purse either, because my purse is pretty small. Hi, Idol Cheese! Small or fake pockets. Yeah, they're either small or fake. It's it's whack. Um The cursor can be moved around with the D-pad. Okay, we got it, we got it. Use the buttons to set and edit notes. B is place note. Except I have several plays somehow. I don't know how I managed that one. <laughs> how messy is my first? It's not messy at all, but that's why I that's why I have a small purse. And then A is cut or paste note. Hmm. I'm using a controller, so I don't know what is bound to what. I'm assuming B is B and A is A. <laughs> and then B plus up, down, left, right is... Edit note. So I already showed you guys that. Hi, Iron Blood! Boom. 
least you only have eight buttons to worry about. It's true. Well, actually, I think there's there's extra buttons on the controller I'm using, so that might get confusing, but... Start changes the mode. Apparently, okay, and then we got L, which is third mode. What is strange? What a strange, uh, way to <laughs> lay out this manual. Okay, L's not doing anything. And then we have R plus, which I'm assuming is the trigger. R and then left, right, and down is a step pause. Oh. This is very, very complex. <laughs> kids and, these are kids in your Nintendos. That's a bum bag for our viewers down under. A fanny pack! A fanny pack, not a bum bag. Don't say that. <laughs> Oh, I understand what's happening. It's, it's it's not playing the so it's going through it four times, and then it's not playing the um whichever one is like whited out, I guess. So it won't be playing that go through. Does that make sense? I'm gonna be so bad at explaining this. Fanny is a rooter in the UK. Yeah. <laughs> I do have the instructions. Yeah, I have them right here. Um, hi, Slango and Dirt Magician. Have you tried putting your analog pocket in your fanny pack yet? I don't have a fanny pack. I wish I did. Uh, and then select is call menu one. Ah, oh, so this is where I can change. Okay, so here's where these different symbols come in. Um, so this is volume envelope. So now that I'm in this, I can go to B to make the volume go higher and lower. Apparently, B plus up and down. Oh! And then it's visually represented by this little square here. Hi, ta -ta Oh, so you can hear it get lower in volume. Pretty cool. And then this is panning. Or no, this is length. It's not panning. Whoa! Oh, cool! Yeah, you know, I don't know if we're actually gonna be able to make any music today, but you know, it's fun to it's fun to play around with and learn this stuff. I feel like that's kind of the goal of today's stream is to just like learn how to use it, you know. Um, and then start goes into envelope mode. Oh. Which I guess changes the like attack. Not really sure how envelope mode works. Oh, it says there are two envelope modes. Decay with no attack. Default click as a click in decay mode. Soft attack as a short attack in decay mode. Attack decay mode. Attack and decay are the same. Wow. This looks really complicated. The reason it looks so complicated is because uh, the interface is, you know, very, very simple. So I had to kind of try and represent things in a uh, very simplified way. So that makes it a little more complicated. Does this support stereo panning? I'm not sure yet. Hi, NES Powerhouse. Um, okay, so... Oh, there are three tonal channels and one for noise. Oh, I wonder if that's the thing that's up at the top. L, R, and S. Supposedly up and down selects a channel. But I wonder if I have to be in the right... Oh! Noise! Here we go! So now, what happens if I... Oh. So you can use that for like percussion. Have you ever played that famous 
NES game Decay Attack way is I real thing. <laughs> Hi Kyoko and Dot Dot. And you can do different different sounds depending on Whoa. Oh my god, you can get so granular, I feel like, and create lots of different... Cool! We're gonna have to restart this at some point though, because I don't know how to remove notes. I bet you have some tunes going by the end of the stream. I hope so. I don't know. I don't know if that's actually gonna... I don't know if we're actually gonna manage, but... I will do my best. Now is offbeat and it's gonna drive me crazy. <laughs> um, okay, let's go to... Hold on, let's get rid of this and this and this. And then I'm going to change the... Uh, see if I can get to the other modes here. Select channel. I have to be menu one to do that. Which is... Which is just having the menu open, it seems. What's S? Ami detector for finding sneaky buckles. It sounds like a radar, if that's what you mean. S. So I guess I just have to wait for this menu to go away. I just want to see what S does. Because it doesn't seem to go away on its own. Or it doesn't seem to go away when I press the button again. Because when I press the button again, it just switches between the menus. Oh, here we go. I had to press B. So what is S? It says polyphonic PWM FM. And then R and L are monophonic. Wait, is it just stereo? And the other ones are, are either the left or the right channel? I think that's the idea. I think Dragon. Sorry if you guys are kind of lost, you know, hopefully. Let's try this. Uh, oh, I'm in the wrong mode. I need to be in the music mode. I can't tell if I'm getting stereo. Wait, let me see. Let me see. I might not have the stereo stuff on. On my capture card. Hold on. Because I remember I had to reset it up at some point. Yeah, if you're lost, just, you know, listen to the sound of my voice. <laughs> oh no, it should be in stereo. Okay, okay. I understand a certain variety of things so far. Okay, good, good, good. We're just gonna, we're just gonna, you know, play around. <laughs> Hi, Shadow the Destroyer. See you. I mean, goodbye. <laughs> Hello, Takashi. Um, oh, it has an explanation for everything. L, R, and S can play a filtered rectangular wave with a variable pulse width or FM with a variable modulation amount and modulation frequency. L and R play chords as arpeggio and have a pitch envelope slash LFO. Um... We figured out what the tracker head appearing in four corners means? What do you mean, tracker head? Polyphonic would still refer to multiple notes at once, right? I think so. Music tracker pro programs can be confusing themselves. Now imagine when this designed to be more minimalist. Yeah, that's why this is very confusing. I don't expect you guys to necessarily... ...be able to follow along that well until we actually get something going. S plays chords as actual chords with a stereo phasing effect and has a filter. Slash modulation PWM FM envelope. N is filter noise with adjustable cutoff and playback speed and arpeggio can be applied to the latter. Cool! Okay, I'm still confused. <laughs> oh wait! I was supposed to be able to pick a color scheme! I want pink! Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. I want to choose pink. I'm gonna restart it so I can do that. Hi, Odysseus. 
Because there's pink squares on a black background. Or on a white background, too. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want. Eh? Come on. Tools. Oh, God. My controller. Oh, God. My controller. Bluetooth disconnected. Come on. Everything's going to heck in a handbasket. <laughs> There we go, okay. Piano loop. Make music. Okay, so starting in a loop. It didn't change color. Lame. <laughs> um Alright, alright. We'll just keep it in black. Why is impressed when you do music tracker stuff even though I don't understand it at all? Don't worry, I don't understand it at all at this point either. So we got we got, we guys us guys, we guys are equally lost. A ham a ham a hand basket. I don't know where that comes from. Um Okay, so volume and envelope, let's just continue looking. So there is volume and envelope, there's pitch, there is pitch bend. Let me put a note and then we'll we'll go to pitch bend and we'll see. And now once I'm in pitch bend, I can press uh, B plus up and down to change the amplitude. Boom. Boom. All the work was worth it for that one bloop. I agree, I agree. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> it's so funny to me. And then start toggles envelope LFO. What does it? A lot of times I've been pressing start and I can't really get it to do anything. So I hope my start is working. I don't know how it wouldn't be. Especially since I just used this controller for stuff. Okay, now this is waveform. Uh, here. You can change the cutoff and modulation. Wow, this stuff is so... Highly technical. Okay, that... That changes the sound like this. <laughs> This just makes that like a higher frequency, I guess. Or, or... Softens it. I, I really don't know enough about the more technical aspects of music to understand this completely. Let's see what happens when we go left to right. Wow. Wow. Very sharp. Wow. Okay, apply some kind of filter. Toggle PWM. See, I don't know if I'm actually toggling anything with the start button. It doesn't, it doesn't seem to be changing anything. And then L. Toggle high pass, band pass filter. Toggle white metallic noise. Hmm. All right, let's go to the next one. This is panning and delay. B plus up and down. Whoa! <laughs> it's like echo reverb. Oh my god, it sounds like a bouncing ball now. And then panning. But this is only for the other two uh, modes, the S and N. So right now it's not going to be doing anything. <laughs> so 
Galatu modes the sound and uh or sorry, noise and stereo. You can only do panning with, with those ones. But I have I'm in the R mode, which is just the right channel, I believe. But if I want to switch between them, I can do that by how. Um I can do that by pressing start. No. No. <laughs> no, I lied. Hold on. God, this is so complicated! Hi, Lord Sente! Can your loyal translator get a happy birthday song for his birthday? Sure! Happy birthday, Sente! Can I do it to the... Can I do it to the tune... To the beat of... Whatever's happening right now. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Sinte. Happy birthday to you. Now, please say happy birthday to Lord Sinte. I have to change my position here. Hold on. Okay, come on. How do I get to the... How do I get to the... This is so complicated. I'm already forgetting everything that I learned. Uh, once I'm in the menu, I can up and down the select channel. Okay. So now that I have stereo... I can go... Here. No, I can go... Here. Oh. I can go here, and then I can, uh, do panning, so let's try it. Okay, I'm hearing a little... Boop. That's only on one side. You side to start going early. There's no, there's no, there's no music yet, you guys. There's no music yet. But we will. We will. Okay. Um, let me see here. And then there's other menus. So this is the file menu. So I guess if you save stuff. And then there's song editor. Oh. Don't know exactly how this works. <laughs> um. Then there's ping pong. What's ping pong? Game? A game. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, it's just going all around. I don't want to do that. No, I changed my mind. <laughs> and then this one is pattern length. Oh God, what is happening? I'm ping pong. I'm ping pong. I'm so confused. I'm so confused. And then this is temple slash sync. So you can change the temple, I guess. How do I change the temple? Up and down? No. Okay, so the temple is displayed there. I see 120, but I don't know how to change it. So I guess we're working at 120 BPM today. Hi, farm animal and fizzle pick. Oh. Uh, okay. And then there's some very strange com button combinations. Like A plus B is prepare slave. I don't know what that means. <laughs> it's kind of scary. Seems like you kind of should have a kind of basic knowledge of how make, like Game Boy music works. But that's okay. We're going to try and do <laughs> stuff. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna try and figure something out. The interface is less intuitive than you imagine. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense because... It, it is all on a teeny tiny Game Boy thingy after all. Um... Alright, is there an option to restart? Because I ping-ponged it and now I don't... Now I don't know how to... <laughs> it's more fun if you just wing it. I think if I winged it, we wouldn't get... Anything done. Anything. I have it! Uh, okay, okay, okay. Um. 
The the manual is also very like bare bones. It's kind of like okay, let me let me restart the program. It's kind of like very confusing the way they describe stuff. So for example, it will say Uh, on startup, the edit parameter is pitch and B plus up down changes pitch with semitone wise, while B plus left right changes the octave. So select the different channel parameter call menu one must select, and then it says step pause, and then it says with R plus le re left right, you can set the step to play only every second or fourth pattern. So, like, I kind of understand what that means, but also I feel like it's written in a very, like, direct way. <laughs> But there is another manual. I'm not sure if this one's different. Step one, turn on Nano Loop Step to create music. Create the Mona Lisa. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just getting it restarted here. So what we're gonna do... I'm gonna kind of maybe try to ignore some more of the advanced stuff. And I'm going to try and kind of just work with some of the basic features. So I'll try and lay down percussion first. See what I can do in terms of that. Tools. Let's see if I can get it to actually be pink this time. Feeling better today? I am! Thank you for asking. Hi, Nathaniel and Viatori. So the reason, the other reason why I feel like my start menu, maybe that my start button doesn't work, even though it does, is because when I press it to change the color, it doesn't do anything at the startup. So, so, but, but that's a very strange thing because, um, this can, there, there's no problem with my controller. <laughs> <laughs> like I know this works. Hi Razzle Dazzle. So I'm I'm like I'm like am I like, kind of doomed here to begin with? But work on one layer at a time, start with the melody and go from there. Well I wanna start with percussion, because if I don't have percussion like a metronome, I'm gonna be super lost. That's just how I work when I make uh music and stuff. So menu and then I'm going to go to N, which changes it to noise. Okay, so now that I'm here, I can place a note. So let's do another. Well, let's do like this. Da, da. Can we get a cat? A cat? We got, we got a boom. Actually, this is not a boom. Uh, let's see here. That sounds like a boom. Cats. Then we need a cat. No, a cat's gotta be here. Hmm. I'm confused. The left column is your quarter note spots, the rest is your in-between stuff. Yeah, but... Why does it seem to be playing... It seems like it's playing, uh... When I put the... The cats here. It sounds like it's playing it every time. But no, I don't think it is. I think that's just how the, that note sounds. Bah, 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 so maybe I want to change this to something. Oh god. Something deeper.
And Emma's up and down. I'm changing modes, but I don't know exactly what that does. With A plus up and down. And then R plus up and down and left and right is meta step, which... What in God's name does that mean? But also, it's not... Oh, that's not right. That's not right. <laughs> Oh, I see. So it's so it's not playing. So the first go through and the third go through, it's not playing the note on the first uh on the first little area here. Okay, so we don't need that yet at least. <laughs> okay, so we got some we got some we got some um Now I suppose if I want to have it play more than just these 16 notes. I suppose what I have to do is go to the song. Uh, what is it? Song editor, which is what? Which is how do I get there? This one. Is it good excuse to have Ami Amiga playing her guitar at the bottom of, of your screen? <laughs> well, she's not really gonna be playing along too much. Let's see if I can place this somewhere. Once I'm in the song, the song menu. And the file menu patterns can be saved. The file slots of flash memory for persistent storage in 120 banks. What do I do? What do I do? Oh god, where did I go? <laughs> oh my god, this is so confusing. Start, switch between file slots and back menu. I paused, but then I unpaused. And then select returns to menu one. But where's my, where's my, where's my sounds? I switched the file, but like, I don't know. It, it doesn't... <laughs> I don't know what the file I started on was. It must be here. But I, but there's nothing. <gasps> what happened? Did you load an empty song? I guess so. Why is my phone making noise? I want to not do that next time. <laughs> my drums, my drums that I so painstakingly, it took me eight, eight, eight hundred hours to, to put my little drums in. Aw, I'm so sad. The weird thing is, it says that this is the this thing I'm in. It says it's called song menu. But then when I go to the thing that looks like this, it says file menu. Oh, song editor. This is where I am. This is where I am. Okay, B plus up and down selects a pattern. Oh. B plus left and right copies current value to next step. Oh, I kind of understand. <laughs> A plus up loads patterns at cursor position. Wait, hold on. Let me turn my phone on. Do not disturb. I don't know why it's making noise at me right now. Get out of here. Uh, A plus left and right turns page. Okay, so this is a different pages. Wow, you can do a lot with this. Like a lot of... A lot of data. Which might, may or may not be useful to me, depending on whether I can... Actually manage to... <laughs> input data. 
Okay, so my left and my right triggers do work, and my F my start button does work because it's starting the song from the cursor position. And then select returns to the menu. Okay, so everything's working, so I don't know why. I'm having trouble doing stuff in certain areas. Okay, let's go back here. Um, we want to change back to noise. Let's put my let's put my drums down again. Wait, what mode am I on? Oh, I'm on stereo right now. Noise. Somehow got into the wrong menu. Oh god, I'm really flubbing this up, you guys. I'm in waveform somehow. I need to get back to... I need to get back to... This is not the correct one! What's happening? <laughs> I'm- I'm in volume envelope. That's not the- I want to be here, not volume envelope. Oh god, now how do I disable the volume- Okay, there we go. Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm freaking out. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> not where I want to be either. Oh my god, I'm panicking, you guys. I just want to get back to the to the start the the place where I started, uh, which is pitch. That's where I want to be. Okay. Ah. <sighs> I am freaking out. I am freaking out. I am freaking out. I'm trying to be entertaining. I thought this would be entertaining, but... <laughs> but I think it's just confusing for everyone. Okay, and then... Does this fix my problem? Okay. All right, we're getting somewhere. I'm back where I want to be. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. <laughs> oh my god. Get rid of this. Okay. Why are you doing this? <laughs> I'm so confused. Get rid of that. I'm getting rid of these things, but it keeps bringing them back. Huh. Guys, I apologize for how lost I am. Uh... Okay. <clears throat> this game is not fun. <laughs> um... Okay, let's get rid of... Oh, God. Get rid of this. Change to noise. Okay, here we go. Oh, 
So I think I can, like, layer these and do a bunch of different sounds at once. Oh god, it just lagged. Maybe I can't do that then. <laughs> Let's go back to zero. I want to get my, um... I want to get my deep sound back that I had. My kick. My boots. If you hold A when changing the envelope, it should do all 16 squares at once. That way you can pick a sensible default. I want the default to be... to be... just what it is right now. Yeah. Wait. No, that wasn't your internet. Will you give the game a one-star review? No. No, just because I don't know how to use it doesn't mean it's bad. Panda, hi! Nice glasses. If you have your other eyes on as well, do you need another pair of glasses? Um... I don't need them. But I would like to put them on as a funny... As a funny, you know. <laughs> Okay. This may be. Okay, that sounds like a kick enough. I don't know why it's also... Uh, there's also like another sound here that kind of sounds like a hi-hat or something. I don't know why that exists. But... We'll just live with it. I feel like it sounds way too similar. They do kind of sound the same, don't they? Thoroughly fascinated by this. Oh, <laughs> but gotta work tonight, so sleep back in. Okay, see you guys. I have a good sleep. I'm trying to figure out why these don't sound different to me at all. Okay, no, that's wrong. We gotta go here. You know, the, the sound... Sounds to me like it's changing slightly every time. I'm not sure what's causing that, but we're, we're gonna work with it. I wonder if watching a video about this would be more helpful to me, but I can't really now that I'm streaming. <laughs> Okay, so now if I go into the, uh, if I... If I switch to this, now I should be able to input notes, I believe. Food dots with tutorial watching time? I don't have food. <laughs> That'd be lame if we just watched a tutorial together. So what I want to do now is I would like to change this. Yeah, I'm sure there's videos. I just can't watch them now, you know. I like to change the way this sounds. Boom. So let me see if I can figure that out.
Uh, so there's volume envelope, there's pitch, there's LFO. Is that what I want or do I want? I want waveform, I think. So I have to go to. Lack of food is something that can be fixed. Are you are, are you offering? What you do now, give hug. <laughs> Here's a hug. Here's a hug. I need a hug. I'm so confused. Whatever makes play more fun for you is best. It's not really the point of the stream to to. Oh. Let's go here. I'm gonna try to make a bassy sound. I don't know how to do it. But I'm gonna try. So this is me changing the pulse width. Are you just wanting to learn the basics? Yeah. Pretty much. <laughs> I can't get it to be deeper. The S channel has a full wave editor to dial in a sound. That's what I'm on right now. But I can't get it to like... Let's see. I'm basically like trying to like... Design a sound. This sounds kind of like a guitar. So I'm wondering if I had a lower pitch it might sound like... A bass note. You know. This is not how Game Boy devs made music at all. <laughs> Okay, so let's see if I can go back to... Here and cha actually change the note lower and see if it sounds... Deep and bassy. I know. Now, that only changed it for one of them, which is kind of a problem. Let's see here. I'm trying to figure out if it, there's a way for me to change it across the board. Hi, Big Z, DJ Ami in the house. Not quite, not quite. <laughs> I'm having some trouble. Mm. There's gotta be a way to do them all at once. Oh, I fell asleep, sorry. <laughs> We're at the studio, we're at- we're at school right now. Okay, so I'm in. So right now I'm in the... Volume envelope. And what I want to do is I want to just change it all for everything. <laughs> Actual Game Boy composers have many interfaces. Nintendo dev Yeah, they didn't like make... They didn't like make... Music... Using the Game Boy. That would just be crazy. <laughs> that would be kind of crazy. So I guess I have to do a Oh, okay. This will copy it. Okay, okay. And then I'll just have to change the, uh... Notes. I don't know how I got a note on every single one of these <laughs> without noticing.
Okay. <laughs> Something's happening. Hi, Otaro. Like something, right? This sounds like this sounds kind of like a song. <laughs> the Ami dialogue BGM for the official play. I mean, visual novel. It sounds like, um... It's just starting to become key gen music, basically. <laughs> it all comes down... It all comes back to key gen music. Sounds kind of Metal Gear-ish? You think so? No way. <laughs> Rubbish Soldier, thank you for the super chat. Remake that. Punk's hits one more time. One more time. I'm gonna celebrate. You've heard shorter loops in games. Okay, well, then I win. I, I made video game music already. <laughs> There's more stuff I can do with this. I can change. I can change the. Oh no, that's in the other menu. Okay. Okay, now let's do a let's do a a melody, and then I will try and um. So ideally, we want this to play like four times, right? And then and then we'll go to something that's similar but different. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. I feel like I'm like the dog in the chemistry lab. Hi, Nadram. We do need the alien gift. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. I have something even better. I have something even better. Where's my dancing song? <sighs> Hold on. <laughs> he can dance to everything. All right, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> We're just gonna keep him. Uh, we'll just keep him. Just keep him up here. Yeah. Oh no, he's going off. We'll just keep him up there. Is that gonna be too distracting for you guys? <laughs> no, right? It's fine. Okay. So I'm gonna do another... Uh... S, I guess. Why do I have that saved? Because mm, I used it before. <laughs> the perfect amount of distraction. Okay, it moves to the beat. I'm telling you, it's a magical gift. He he dances to everything. It's, a ma it's magic. Bum, bum, uh. Oh, but you know what? I have to go to one of the other channels, so if I don't, it's gonna affect the sound. So let's just go to L.
I'll change the sound after. I'll change the sound after. Hi, Sorcerer. Okay, we're getting somewhere. Okay, now we have to sound change the sound of this because it sounds way, 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 way too similar to the bass. <laughs> okay, so let's do this. Huh. Oh god, what have I done? Alright, let's see here. Copy paste function that I don't exactly know how to use. I just did it. I just did it on the other thing. Hold on. Oh god, how did I just open a feedback hub for Microsoft? Oh my god. I meant to press Control F. I think I pressed Windows F. <laughs> Okay, when I when I started this stream, I thought we're gonna make a whole song. I'm gonna learn it really quick because I'm good at learning stuff. It's gonna be epic. And then it just like a few minutes ago, I was in total doom mode. I was like, this is sucks. This is the worst. This is not entertaining at all. And now I'm back to being like, and now I'm back to being like, um, um, um. I feel like I can maybe do something with it. And then now I'm going back to is. And now I'm going back to... This is terrible. <laughs> the doom was gone momentarily, but it's now back. Uh... Hi, what is my brain in meetings when I should be focusing? <laughs> uh, we might switch it up to something else soon. We'll see. We'll see if I can figure it out. to copy paste out in God's name did I do that before Sticker. Uh, I'm glad you guys are jamming. Sorry, boss. Spider Man's moves are too fresh. We have Spider Man to entertain you guys. At least. This might be above my head. I feel like this happens every time I try and use new music software on stream. I kinda, I kinda flub it up. Uh. But also, this manual is not very helpful. I keep changing my DPS. <laughs> and now I have to roll back around too, so you guys are gonna hear the windows noise a bunch more. The windows effect fits the song. I don't even think it's in the same key. The manual sounds like it's kind of assuming a level of knowledge. It kind of does. It kind of does. Do mode on me makes me think of your face being in the middle of a bottom with your armor, health, and ammo around it. No, it's like me with 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 tears streaming down my face. Why? <laughs> Changing 
DPS optimizing the Ami build. I think I'm optimized. <laughs> I watched a video. Okay, let's just mess around with what we got then. Ooh! I don't think this is gonna do much unless the notes are like side by side. So this is the... LFO mode. Which does what? You don't know. But it makes it sound cool. Makes it sound cool ish. Hi, wet, stinky socks. Why are your socks wet and stinky this time? That's the technical term, I think. <laughs> I feel like my brain just doesn't work in this type of... Like... Sequencer way, you know? I feel like I need it, I need it, I need it like in, in like... Uh, Ableton DAW format to be able to do stuff. Uh, let's see here. Why their socks are? I do, I do. Why'd you step in a puddle? One of the ways to display music. Yeah, I'm not familiar with sequencers. Is the, I think the main issue here. So probably in hindsight might have been a good idea to start with something a little simpler. Let's see if we can go to the file menu. And save this to a file. Okay. How does can be saved the file slots in flash memory for persistent storage in 128 banks? In each bank, there's a row of 15 slots for each channel. Slot 0 is not writable, but can be used to load an empty pattern. Select returns to menu 1. In the lower row, one of the 8 banks can be selected. When switching to another bank, the bank's waveforms are loaded, which may result in sudden sound changes. What? <laughs> what? slots and bank menu. Okay, select channel, select file slot, save current channels pattern to file slot. Okay, 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 okay. Let's do... Okay, so that saved the noise, I think. Bum, bum, bum. And then... This will save this one. And then we have the... What was it? The left channel. Bum, bum, bum. Okay. So... Those are saved. So now what I have to do is... I have to go to... Here. Oh god. And now I should be able to... You can save RSN and make multiple L's for lead and assemble it in the song editor. Yeah, but this is the song editor, but I don't understand how this works. This is why this is what I'm thinking. Uh that's very strange looking. Okay. Let me just get rid of everything. So this is R, so I don't have anything on R. So I have to worry about that. L. So, theoretically, if I want to... So, 
So let's say I want to have the same drum beat throughout. I'm pretty sure I can do this. Wait, it's way too long. Wait, what happened? I've done it again. I've done it again! <laughs> ah! I'll get back to the page I was on. Um. Here we are, okay. Okay, there we go. Why you take me to another page? Okay, so for now, let's go... We're gonna take this off. So the first one doesn't do anything, I guess? I'll just leave it blank. So then shouldn't this be playing twice? Oh, I'm, I'm starting it from the cursor position. Ah, I see. So here. Okay, we're so back. We're so back again for the, for the bazillion time today. <laughs> Now if I do this. <laughs> no! No! You go back to the page that I want you at. Okay. Um... Okay, I'm just gonna alternate these and see what it sounds like. <laughs> this is lame sounding. <laughs> okay, here's what I wanna do. I want to go to... This. And I want to... Now, my question is, I wonder if I need to... Select a... Uh, hold on. I need to... Do I need to select a new file, I wonder? Or can I just kind of... Let's see here. Select file slot. So as long as I'm here, I think we'll be good. So now my question is, do I erase? It does it for me. Okay. N now that I'm in, in a different slot. Okay. So. So I want another one that goes like. Right. Bum 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 bum. 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 Bum bum. Bum 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 bum. I have a vision, you'll see. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. 
Bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. 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 Okay, now we're gonna save this. We're gonna go here. I'm gonna save this to... Slot 2. You know what? How do I... I want to get it to sound the same. As the other bass that I have. You know what I mean? Because I, I have I have the bass that I did in this file. Um, hi, Red Ranger. Make any bus and beats? Not at all. Not at all. This program seems pretty sweet. It's fun. I mean, it's neat. <laughs> so I need to copy paste. Yeah. Now, is there a way to do that? B plus up loads it. And then I can save it with this. So now that this is saved... I should be able to change it without affecting the other one. Hopefully, let's try. Um, here is where I want to go. What no am I playing in my mind here? Boom, boom, boom. 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 Now that I have... Okay, now here's my problem. This is, never stops playing, it just keeps looping and looping. So if I'm trying to figure out a note, all the other notes are... ...burning into my mind. I hinge. Okay, this is kind of what I'm thinking. It's very haunted house. Walking on the moon's surface in a suit or lost in the deep forgotten cave comes to mind. I feel like it is Luigi's Mansion vibes. <laughs> Hi, Jeeves, Miss Crest. Um, okay, so now I should be able to go here and put two. Oh god, what did I do? I started playing a different pattern somehow. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine! Spoopy core, yeah. Okay, let's see if this does anything. No! <laughs> Why they sound identical? Oh, I think I didn't save it, Mimi. Maybe I didn't save it. But I think I... I think I ruined it now, because I think I... Oh... Oh... Hi, Koseki and Fuzzy Ducky. Finding a skeleton boss is Booby Mansion when it switches to its second phase. 
<laughs> it's not layered though because what I wanted to do is what I what I wanted to do is I wanted to change. I wanted to have a second base type of situation. But the base just sounds exactly the same somehow. And I'm not sure how that happened. Second phase is a dance off. But but the, the problem is I had it so that Huh. How did I cause this problem? I don't know what my problem is. My problem was I create I my intent was to create two different base files. Oh James Pot, thank you for the 17 months. I mean, with the sick jams. Keep it up and keep having fun. This is good background music while I pack for AX. Oh, have fun at AX. Um, I, I was trying to create two different, like, bass tracks, right? So that... Uh, this is what I want? No. This is what I want. See, so like, why... Well, Why are they the same? I just changed it. Let's try again. Okay, so this is, this is what we got. And then I need to go to here and I need to save it with B and down. Let's save it to three, maybe, you know. Let's save it to both so that I have a wide margin for error. Oh god, why did it affect the sound so much? <laughs> the ba -da -ba 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 sounds so weird now. Oh my god, it's been an hour and a half and I've done nothing. Nothing. I think these should be gone. I'm learning. <laughs> Am I though? Am I though? <laughs> Made a lot of bloops and bleeps. Eh? This is true. You're hanging out with us. Does that count? I mean, of course that counts as doing something, but... I want you guys to be not bored, you know? I think I need to change this so that it is... Um... Okay, maybe this is better. You, you guys are employed, you're having a you're having a fun time. That's fine, as long as you guys are having fun. Save. Save, okay. And then... This? And then let's play it. Okay. 
Okay, okay, okay. But now I have a fun time with the life of the party on top. Oh, Spider-Man! Oh man, you're gonna say me. You're a music nerd, do you love this? Can you like figure it out for me and then transfer your knowledge into my brain? I'm still at work and this is a nice to listen to while doing stuff. Okay, 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 okay. I need the comfy vibes to deal with here. Cause as long as you guys are having fun. That's all that matters. Uh. All right, so we got something now. <laughs> and it's this. Play! There we go. <laughs> See, now I'm wishing I, I just had like a... Uh... Hi, Tech! Rick is crazy, so this helps me. If it's crazy, are you allowed to be distracted by watching me? Um, this is very wishing I was just able to like put... Like, just take my mini controller and be like... Da -da 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 -da. Am I having fun? Hmm. I... am going between having fun... and not having fun. <gasps> right now I'm having fun. Five minutes ago, I was not. <laughs> I'm not bored, I'm frustrated. Thank you, Spider Man. You're so helpful, Spider-Man. Just want to keep listening to it while I try and figure out what to do next with the melody. Cause my ba da 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 was too too like upbeat and and <laughs> it was too upbeat and not like uh we're we're going spooky now is what's happening so I need to revert to spooky vibes so I'm just trying to listen to it until I figure out what I want to do. Something long and droning over it. That sounds like a. I want to. I want to. I want to. I want to. I want something that sounds like bagpipes. No, not bagpipes. Organ. I want organ. Bah. Bah. That's what an organ sounds like. It goes. Bah. <laughs> Team of Ami hanging on our ceiling watching us do stuff. Wait, you think that's creepy? That shouldn't be creepy. That should be... That should be... The theme song to that should be... Uh, let's see here. Why are you guys doing sheep? Why are you guys spamming sheep? <laughs> uh, it should be... It should be... Um... That's what that's what the music should be if I'm on your guys' ceiling. What the heck? Um Beep beep I'm a jeep beep beep I'm a oh a sheep a sheep sheep are known to sound like an organ. That's not true. 
<laughs> Good morning, yeah. When you wake up and the first thing you see is Ami on your ceiling. You know. <laughs> okay, let's load up this pattern and then... We shall try and create an organ sound somehow. So I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna put a note. And we're just going to try and alter the sound. Until... Here we go. Until... It sounds like an organ. The best part of waking up is I'm beyond your ceiling. <laughs> What's with Spider-Man? He dancing. What if the song is playing when Ami is watching us is careless whisper sad? What? What? <laughs> I don't like the implication. <laughs> okay, I need to change the... Okay, let's, let's go here. Need something long, but not that long. I need a talent and bionic hit both. Spider Mom is greater than Spider Man. Yeah! Thank you. What am I done? Ooh. Spooky. I'm mean, watching us, but she can see all the cups on her nightstand. Take those out of your room. I mean, it's guilty feet that got no rhythm. My feet have rhythm. Listen. It sounds like it's flatlining. Oh no! <laughs> Mr. Sun, thank you for the 17 months. I'm surprised someone has written a Boris the Spider parody as Ami the Spider. You could write it. Oh my god, I'm dying. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, my heart is giving out. Uh, oh wait, I was supposed to die. What happened? There we go. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm fine. I'm fine, I'm fine. No! Don't! Don't find a new Oshi, no! <laughs> Someone call Dr. Mario, what's he gonna do? I'm fine. <laughs> I got better. Okay, now I want to change the sound. This sounds kind of organy around this kind of area. No CD Ayami! Dr. Mario is not certified. He's like a... He's like a chiropractor. <laughs> I think I'll just keep this because I don't know what I'm messing with when I'm messing with that sort of thing. Rude. I'm sorry, Mar Wait, is it rude to the chiropractors or rude to Dr. Mario? <laughs> okay. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I forgot. It's only in one. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> I don't remember how to copy paste. Ah! Did I even ever figure it out? Who knows? Who knows? Oh. 
Mm -hmm. Why don't you just tell me how to copy and paste? Why isn't it playing the first sound anymore, though? There it goes. Oh, because it's getting cut off. Oh, I guess I'll just have to do this manually. It's so impossible to visually match... Match it up. Move the second one. Well, <laughs> this might be as far as we're gonna get. Wow, wow. B plus. My instincts say B plus down saves, but I'm scared that it's not intuitive. We B plus down saves. Okay, okay. Okay, and then we go. We got. We gotta go. Okay, now we go. <laughs> this is so dumb. This is nothing. It sounds like a freaking bee buzzing by. <laughs> it's so stupid. I have to change it to like a brown. with the other ones, which is nice. Uh. Hi, Ointy! I'm kind of getting the hang of it, but it's still very confusing to me. But I'm kind of like learning how to do something. Dorky way to this, of course. Gotta hit him at the lavender town. You know, it probably would be a better challenge to try and recreate something than to make a whole new song. It'd probably be an easier challenge. Okay, now let's go. Okay, we're gonna do this.
Okay. Wow, wow. Then we need something that, that, that goes... We need something for here. Wow. 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 Wow, wow. We need a wow. We need a wow. Wow. Okay. Wow, wow. Okay. Oh, Wow. 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 Okay. Save. Okay. This is kind of what I want, but not quite. Yeah, not at that timing. Here? Wait, it didn't make any noise. Okay, you know what? Yes, at that timing. <laughs> Block, but it's. I gave up. <laughs> I gave up. Hi, Raziel. You didn't miss the music king? Uh, I think that's all we're doing right now. <laughs> um. Okay, now I want I want something like a high pitch, like. Wait, do I still have a channel I can use for that? Uh. I don't think I do. <laughs> okay, never mind. <laughs> uh, hi, Dan Prime and Rosa Kane in. Okay, here's our song. This is it. This is the final song. <laughs> Wait, no, I'm not using the L channel for anything. Wait! Wait a second. Okay. Saved. <laughs> It does sound like a body was murdered, and then the body was disappeared. Gradually. Ooh, that's kind of fun. I 
don't know if I like it, but it's kind of fun. <laughs> this do again? Oh, it's like a delay. But that, yeah. This is a banger. Okay. Uh, here. Save. Right, and then... Why is Spider-Man dancing? He's... Because he likes my music. He likes my music. I need it to be a different note. Uh... It's got some Samba vibes. So dumb. Uh... What happened? Oh, I didn't put it. Oh. 
god. Oh god, I'm not gonna be able to remember. I need to load the other stuff as well. Is what I need to do. This is what I want. No! 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 Oh, no! <laughs> no, B, B, B. Sorry, I freaked out <laughs> for no reason. <laughs> Go back, go back, go back, start from the beginning. So I'm kind of understanding the flow, the workflow of this type of sequencer now. The idea is you can like mix and match. You can like mix and match the different kind of tra tracks. So if I want to have like um. It's kind of like, uh, you know, making music via a loop, in a way. Like when I do live looping. You just have a couple of different, uh, you know, setups. A couple of different, like, patterns, and then you can kind of mix and match them. At least one of us understands. I'm, I, I understand it, but it's still not really my ideal workflow. But we made something, at least. <laughs> it's been two hours, oh my god, I have to pee! Oh, Woozy! Hi! Hello, Woozy! Oh my god, that was so high-pitched and annoying. I apologize. <laughs> oh, I, I meant to give you a wrench and I almost pinned you. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. Hi, Woozy! This is so cute. Oh my god, there was lots of blood, sweat, and tears to get to this point. <laughs> the UI is not exactly user friendly. It's it's so hard to make a user friendly UI with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten buttons basically. Well, twelve technically if you include start and now they do a lot of uh you have a lot of like different combinations that you can use, but but that's what makes it kind of esoteric. To, to be able to use. So... You know, very cool that you can use this to make music in that way. And there are definitely some people who are like... Creative enough to be able to like pick up any kind of... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Any kind of... 
form fact... Uh, any kind of, like, form factor of music creation and see it as a challenge and see it as, like, I want to be able to make music on this, but... It's very difficult. Dwarfforge is a music-making software. But we created something kind of cool and, like, kind of, like, uh... Metal Gear Solid, Luigi's Mansion-esque. You know. the notes in the squares to loop, but when you get further than that, I get kind of lost. So this screen is... Uh, on a previous screen, I saved um, different patterns to different files. So this is me setting up those different patterns. So for example, uh, you know, on my noise track, which I'm using as my drum track, um, I just have the same pattern playing the entire time. And then this one, I have alternating between two different patterns, uh, as well as this one. And this... this one is three different patterns, actually. So... Yeah, this is just where you're setting up how, how... You're laying out where you want... What tracks to be and how you want it to sound, but... What did I, what did I do? <laughs> but it's definitely very... Painstaking, very difficult. I can see if you get familiar with it, being able to do some really cool stuff with it, but... I don't know if it's my cup of tea, per se. <laughs> Okay, I have to use the bathroom uh, really quickly, you guys. I will be right back. Okay, please uh, just dance like Spider-Man while I'm gone. Okay.
and I'm on Mia. Thank you guys for dancing like Spider-Man while I was gone. Thank you so much, Woozy, for joining the membership. And becoming a Bakuzi. Thank you. That's so, so, so sweet. I appreciate that so much. Uh, if you guys are not familiar uh, with Woozy, Woozy is with my Hollow TV. And Woozy also plays retro games. Pretty cool. Pretty, pretty, pretty swell gal. So you should check her out. <laughs> Then I'm a Mia. Thank you, Gento and Riding Soul and Turbo for the blue super chats. Just a little guy, just a little wooz. <laughs> just a little loser. <laughs> Wait, that sounds like loser. I don't like that. That sounds like loser, but I have like, uh, you know, a speech. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like that. I'm not gonna call you a loser. I'm gonna call you. I don't know. <laughs> She's also smelly. What do you mean too? What do you mean also smelly too? What is it? Can you elaborate? Can you elaborate? <laughs> uh... Ami, Mama, and Woo's bro are making a complete family here. Huh. <laughs> I know, it's too silent. Can I be... Can I be honest with you guys? I'm in stream. Um. Oh, Gaio, thank you for the 17 months. Please adopt her as your son. You are all... All buckles are all my children. All my children. <laughs> um. Can I, can I be real with you guys? Can I be honest? Hi, young immortal. Um. I don't want to use this thing anymore. <laughs> I don't really want to use this thing anymore. <laughs> <laughs> but you were just getting results is so frustrating. It's so frustrating. I mean, I did get results. Is the thing. It's not like I um. Why you got us all scared? Why 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 were you scared? I mean, it's not like I like gave up. I I I. I persevered through the... Oh yeah, we can bring Spider-Man back. I persevered through the... Um, Hi, CR! Well, that doesn't mean the stream is over. That doesn't mean the stream is over. Um, I persevered through the frustration and I ended up making a little bit... A little something, but I... Um, I don't want you guys to like think I'm giving up or anything. So that's why I pushed through and, you know, tried to actually make something, but... It was kind of... Very, very... Here's what I should have done. Here's my... Here's my hindsight is 2020 situation. My idea for the stream... Was that... It would be like other streams where I learn, you know, some kind of software... Where I have... Let me... Let me fix this. Some other kind of software where I have... I do not have Ableton ready to go, no. Um... No, I'm not trying to cover you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, my intention was... We would have a stream... Where I... Learn software kind of similar to how we did with, uh, you know... Pico 8 or, uh, you know, pre bam base or whatever it's called. Um, and I thought I would just kind of go into it blind, but that was not the right choice. I should have... I should have... Um... I, I should have looked into it more to make sure that it was... Uh, Something that would... Uh, I kind of... I kind of got too big for my britches, you know? I kind of assumed that I'd be able to learn this thing no problem because I'm like pretty okay at learning stuff. And, um... And, uh... I wasn't really able to pick up on it as fast as I had hoped... I, I, I hoped I would be able to do. So, I apologize for that, you guys, but... Um... We learned, we learned a little something. You seem to learn it pretty well. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean, I learned a little bit of it, but I think it's... One of those things that's gonna be better to not learn on stream for the first time. 
<laughs> Many such cases wait are there? I feel like that doesn't happen to me with me that often, you know. I don't want I don't want you guys to think I'm not uh like uh thinking these things through, you know. Uh time spent in the lab is never wasted. Science was done and bloops were made. Bloops were made and we made a song. We made a song. <laughs> I don't want you guys to think I'm not thinking these things through, but you know, sometimes sometimes I have a stream idea and it just doesn't work out that well. I feel like that's one of those times. This is one of those times. You're gonna be the king of the playground when you master it. All the kids will give you their ice cream sandwiches. Could you imagine having something like this in, you know, elementary days or whatever and actually being able to use it? <laughs> You're also Stymed? What does that mean? Stymied by how little you're picking up. Uh... All part of the process. Yeah, I suppose. I just hope you guys aren't like disappointed or... Or bored or anything, but... You know... Uh... Probably get pulled into a science fair school exposition... Or school exposit... Oh, it's a school exposition. Stymied? What does stymied mean, though? Um... You had a good time? Okay, okay. As long as you guys weren't, weren't bored or anything, that's all that matters. I was happy till now, so beep boop for a nice background noise. Oh! Did it give you... Did it give you a nightmare? <laughs> it's kind of spooky. Halted, stopped, ceased. Oh, I never heard that. Um... Did we poke your brain too hard yesterday? Did you poke my brain yesterday? This seemed to demand more attention than previous learning streams. Yeah, it's kind of completely different than anything that I've ever used before. So anyway, I, I just apologize that this was kind of a, a, a flop of an idea. Sorry if I wasn't commenting much, I'm just leaving. No, 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 that's okay, that's okay. Uh, you were having a nap too. <laughs> Doesn't brain poking mean automatic? See? Oh yeah, we were talking about that yesterday. Where, where like you can't, um, you can't. There's no nerve endings in the brain, so you can't hurt someone's brain. But you can. This Spider Man is so distracting to me. <laughs> um, his flop area era is low key serving when being cute. Is the what does this mean? You guys are confusing me so much today. You you guys in your you guys in your hip young people language, I well, I guess stymied is not really. <laughs> My flop era is low-key serving when being cute is the vibe. Does that mean I'm serving right now or being cute? <laughs> Looks like you arrived too late. Oh well, can always catch up the VOD. Yeah, check out the VOD. We did some stuff. <laughs> I think I need to get rid of Spider-Man. I'm sorry, you guys. Um you gotta get with the trends, get the grimace shake. I... No, I can't. Because they don't have an army planet. But even if they did, I wouldn't. Okay, because I am not susceptible to that kind of marketing. No, I would totally get the grimace shake. <laughs> oh, people words and zoomer speak coming at me from both sides, truly. But I, I'm, 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 I'm just here, uh... You know what? I, I kind of... I just never heard stymied, but usually I'm good with the boomer speak, you know? Um... But yeah, I think if I drank the Grimace Shake... The Grimace Shake is purple. I am an Arby's gal. First of all, Arby's milkshakes are freaking amazing. Amazing. Uh, I've had out now. You did a great job, Fab. Far better than I could. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You have a good day. Thank you for coming. I'm be playing with fire by risking the grimace attack. Okay, so just let me explain. Arby's milkshakes are way better than McDonald's milkshakes. And I bet Arby's, if they had a special themed milkshake, they would make it available on Ami Planet and also America. <laughs> we I think I think they would they would put it in both places, but the Downside to that for me is that the nearest Arby's to me is like an hour away. So I just can like never get Arby's and it's very sad. Who's gonna come for me? Mickey D is never the best, just the most available. And it's very, very consistent. Now... 
Now, uh, what do you think Grimace tastes like? That's the other thing. If I tried this milkshake... It's purple. It's purple. So... I think that's cannibalism. Maybe like I was drinking a bako. You're eating Arby's right now? I'm so jealous. <laughs> oh yeah, they had the meat mound. That's insane. Did they make the Dream Cycle Arby's milkshake available on Ami Planet? I don't know because it takes me... I, ha I have to drive an hour to get there and I like never do that. <laughs> How do I know what it tastes like if everyone dies after drinking it? They're like, it tastes like... Blooper. And then they die. And then you're like, I guess they were gonna see Blueberry. Hi, Rasek! Uh, as a former music producer and a gamer that had the analog pocket, using the Nano Loop is a bit confusing. Just a little bit. <laughs> you try playing with a little sound DJ software for Game Boy since it works on the pocket. Ooh, little sound Game Boy. Little sound DJ software. Let's look. Don't drink the Grimace shake is made of buckles. I thought it was made of Grimace. Okay. This also looks very confusing, but... <laughs> the nail lift can generate tones that can break a speaker. Sounds like it's too... What? Oh, God. <laughs> I should not be playing with that. Uh, McDonald's had nothing to do with the sun appearance of this completely organic Grimace shake meme. You think they did? Not... You think they did, though? Uh... <clears throat> And just shove Grimace into the machine and get a hundred shakes out of him. You know how uh, astounded I was that some people just figured out who Grimace was? I saw on Twitter. They're like, who in God's... People are like, who in God's name is Grimace? I have never seen this per this character before. And I'm like, what do you mean, who is Grimace? You don't know Grimace. Ow. <laughs> He's like the, the one of the... One of the McDonald's characters. Am I just... Is this an also old? Nobody can name the bird girl. That's a uh, Tweety Bird. No, I can't. <laughs> She's like the french fry bird or whatever, right? You think it's manufactured? Aww. I thought it was an organic meme. Are they don't know about the hamburger burglar? <laughs> the hamburger burglar. They dropped their model friends by the early 2000s. Not early 2000s. Come on. Come on. They don't even have the clown anymore. Ronald McDonald. Then what the heck do you call Ronald McDonald House Charity? McKids stream? When? I actually played McKids on stream. I don't remember what for exactly. Uh, McDonald's has not used their characters for a long time. No way it's early 2000s. Hold on. What's it called? McDonald's McFriends. <laughs> When was the last time I saw the clown? When I was um, watching the uh, UN Owen was her uh, YouTube video. <laughs> the Mayor McCheese administration. I do I remember Mayor McCheese. The what now? The and then and then and then and then Ronald McDonald is. Is falling off a bench backwards. Do you remember the Fry Kids? Yeah, they're like little, little, like fluffy, like floofy, floofy dudes, right? Haven't seen that forever. Yeah, that's the last time I saw Ronald McDonald. <laughs> Ronald McDonald House Charity has his hand in the logo. At least, look, they're still using him. They're still using the clown. They're still using the clown. Okay, Ronald uh, McDonald's characters. Ronald McDonald from 1971 to 2009. He had French fry bags for pockets. <laughs> he seldom appears after 2016 due to clown scares in recent years. Uh, everybody has always been afraid of clowns, always, forever. And after the whole killer clown thing, they're like, we can't have Ronald McDonald anymore, ever, at all. <laughs> oh, thank you, Megan, for posting the link to the, uh, McKids. So, 
Sunday, Ronald's dog, and then there's Grimace. He's a purple character. I think he is a chicken nugget. He's kind of shaped like the chicken nugget shapes. And then... Of course, we all know the Hamburglar. Birdie the early bird. Wait, isn't that what I called her? I called her Birdie, right? I was right, I think. The clown... The killer clown... Yeah, Blight. Hi, Miss Blum. How many buckles are afraid of IRL spiders? That's a great question. How many of you guys are... Why is my tongue sticking out? <laughs> oh, I called her Tweety. <laughs> How many of you guys are afraid of spiders, IRL? And if so, let me threaten you with my with my spider eyes. <laughs> not anymore, aww. But that really does not translate to being afraid of, you know, just because you're afraid of spiders doesn't mean you're going to be afraid of spider girls now. Um. <laughs> so I'm at someone in my bedroom and now I'm allowed to do a spider thing. Aww. Yeah, t send, give me pictures. Give me pictures of, of the spiders. I mean, as afraid of birds, I am not afraid of birds. <laughs> Originally, I had birds uh, in my um, dislikes in my in my debut, but then we played webbed. It was like the first game I played, and then the and then the and then the bird uh, died. Or no, he didn't die. <clears throat> we drove the bird out of the area in webbed, you know. And it made me so sad and I cried. I would not punch a goose, no. <laughs> oh, you want to pet jumping spider? I'm like a jumping spider, you know, cute and fuzzy. My spider legs are cute and fuzzy. Just like you know. No, the bird didn't die. The bird just, um. The bird just got tackled to the ground and then and then we had to we had to kick him out of town and it was really sad. You didn't even hurt it and it made you cry because because the bird was just listen, the whole premise of that was so sad. The bird was just trying to just trying to Oh what lights do I have on right now? Hold on. The bird was just trying to eat food, you know. And they, but the bugs are getting eaten, so the bugs didn't like him. But but it's in a bird's nature to just try and eat food. It's in everyone's nature to just try and eat food. You know. So I felt bad that we were we were messing with them so much when all he wanted to do was just eat some food. <laughs> Hi Cyrus, I've been afraid of spider girls since birth. <laughs> the whole time watching has been exposure therapy. Well, is it working? <laughs> Ba -da -da. I mean, really, creatures by their desire to eat foods. No, I'm just saying he was just trying to survive, you know. You should eat on stream now. Oh, I don't have food right now. But probably this week. Um, what am I? What am I thinking? What is my schedule like? Yeah. For this week. On Friday specifically. Okay, we're watching a movie. I can definitely watch a movie and eat at the same time, I think. Right. I think that's fine, right? Movie and collab. So I can, I can, we can have, maybe we can have food together during Galaxy Quest if you guys are interested in that. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. Oh god. <laughs> Excuse me? Movies with friends, yeah, yeah. So we're gonna watch Galaxy Quest. Um, thank you for the bunch of tisker. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Um, we're gonna watch um Galaxy Quest, which is like I guess it's like a Star Trek parody. 
you know. Is the idea... It's like... 80s... 90s sci-fi parody is, is kind of the idea, I think. That movie should be a hoot. I think... I think it's really funny, although... I don't know. I'm not like the, the biggest, like... Tim Allen fan, but... It's a parody, kind of, but a serious... It's a serious movie. Oh no. I don't think it's as wacky as... I don't think it's as wacky as, <laughs> as Spaceballs. Oh yeah, Alan Rickman is in it. True, true, true. Yeah, that makes up for this. <laughs> thank you, thank you, sorry. <laughs> uh, don't make fun of the weird noise I make after I sneeze. Don't. <laughs> don't make fun of my weird noise after the sneeze is over. Stop, stop, stop. Uh. Uh, sorry. Yeah, um, you know, may he, may he rest in peace, but Alan Rickman is in that movie. And then there's a girl whose name I don't know, and I covered her up in the thumbnail. If you guys didn't see, I posted the west, re west of my, the... I take a long. Posted the west... Ah! Posted the rest of my waiting rooms. And I, uh... <laughs> and, um... So, if you look at the Galaxy Quest one... The girl... The girl is in the middle... Uh, originally, but I put my head over her so that way... You guys cannot give her plot eyes in the freaking, uh, waiting room. <laughs> for Ami, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, but you, you won't even have to specify it's for Ami. Uh, where is this week's ASMR art come from? No, not for the original girl, for Ami. Not for Azura, for Ami, for Ami. Yes, you can give me plot guys. In fact, you have to give me plot guys. You can't give anyone else plot guys. Eh? And then, um. Yeah, so that's a noteworthy uh, thumbnail. Um, good night, Akatsuki. Thank you for coming. That's a noteworthy thumbnail. Also, the tea ceremony thumbnail got an update. And I really enjoy the Sonic Spinball one a lot, too. Because... I put a buckle... In place of Sanic. In place of the spin... The, the original spin baller. So... I don't know. I, I try my best. <laughs> um, Nintendo fan, please stop asking for other people's... Uh, uh, YouTube links to subscribe to them. That is against my rules. I'm going to time you out. Please review my rules, okay? Do not have personal conversations. Um... You love the smug smile... Wait... Oh! In the Sonic Spinball one, yeah. <laughs> the thumbnails are cute this week. Thank you, thank you, thank you! I'm glad you guys like it. Sigourney Weaver is epic. Is she... Is she the girl in the movie? Sigourney Weaver? No, right? Sigourney Weaver is old, was older than that during this time, wasn't she? It is! Wait, isn't she... Isn't she in that... Uh... Movie with the, with the Harrison Ford and the... Oh, she's Ripley and Alien! Oh... Old women can still rock. No, no, that's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. Please, let's pluck her eyes, her out of respect. No. Wasn't she in a movie with Harrison Ford, boss, boss lady? <laughs> movie. Boss lady movie. I'm gonna Google. No, not boss baby. <laughs> it's like Harrison Ford. Boss... Working girl! Working girl, that's what it's called. Is she in that? Yeah, she is! Okay, she is... Freaking... Gorgeous... Okay. In that movie, basically, obviously she's gorgeous, but you get to just see a bunch of, um... Women in, like, women's... Uh... Office wear. That entire movie. The outfits, 
The outfits are incredible. <laughs> yeah, you can get flock eyes for Sigourney Weaver. Never mind. I changed I changed my mind. I changed my mind. I'm trying to find one of her outfits. Uh because I love her office wear in that in in that um in that movie. So I'm trying to find a good picture. As a former OL Yeah, I, I, I used to be an OL, so you know, I mean I don't wear suits like that, but I wore mostly like Sweaters and uh, pants, sadly. Yeah, tragically. Um, that's how you're selling it to us. It's working. Yeah, yeah. So, so hold on. Let me, let me, let me find a picture. Those monsters. I know. I mean, I guess I could have worn a dress, but it's just too much work to. To go to sleep. Good night, Ria. Thank you for coming. It's just too much work to like. Find like a dress that's appropriate for a, an office workplace like that, you know? Because you can't have it be too casual. So, oh my leg, <laughs> my half, my half steppy. Yeah, how do you guys feel about after after some time? How do you guys feel about the half steppy? Do we are we are you still digging it? <laughs> Bam pants. I cannot find any pictures of. Any good pictures of Sigourney Weaver in this movie? Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You like it? Here, I'll just show you this one. God, she's gorgeous. Uh, you want full steppy? Here, I can do full steppy, but I have to change outfits. There we go. <laughs> oh my god, these glasses and this hair and this outfit! <gasps> I love playing dress up. <laughs> I've noticed women really find her attractive. She is really attractive. <laughs> she is, she is. Uh... Yeah, 2.0 full steppy and then one point, my 1.5 we went with the half step. I thought it was cute. I thought it was cute. I was given the option, but I wanted to try something different. You know. Um, I give up. I can't find any pictures. Just Google Sigourney... Sigourney... Just Google Sigourney Weaver, uh, working girl. Cute, nerdy rock... Hey! Who are you calling nerdy? Hey! What do you mean, nerdy rock girl? You telling me? You telling me? You don't, you don't think rockers can wear glasses? Hey, Banner. Army three point zero will be even more steppier. I really want. I don't want to spoil anything or anything. I'm not. I, obviously, I have like zero plans so far for, um, for a third outfit. Cause my second outfit, I like just got it. But I'm thinking, wouldn't it be great if? We had the short, curly hair. Ami. As a third outfit. Just like I drew in this picture. How curly are we talking? I'll show you. I'll show you. Because look at this. What is this? Oh, by the way, yeah, I drew this. I forgot to show you guys. I drew this picture. Uh, it's an expansion on my um, MS Paint doodle that I did. I just kind of refined it and made it better. And people seem to really, really, really enjoy the drawing for some reason. I don't know what it is about it. If it's the fluffy curly hair or the jacket. But I just decided to do a little bit of a nicer version because people seemed to like it so much. But I'm thinking this kind of hair, you know? <gasps> Wouldn't that be cute? Uh, short curly hair would look really good on a cuddly monster girl... Spider girl body just saying... Mm, I, don't, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Uh... Did you base this off a character? No. No, no, no. I just... I just... 
I wanted to do the lo the 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 big jacket meme that's been going around on Twitter, and I just really like the short short hair. I don't know. What do you think about the outfit? About this? It's not really an outfit. It's kind of a jacket. <laughs> just kind of a jacket and socks, isn't it? It's not really an entire situation. Pretty sure it's the hair and thighs. The thighs, the thighs are always there though. I always, I always, I always, I always, I always, I always give you guys the thighs. <laughs> it's my favorite. No, there's nothing wrong with a simple outfit. No, I think it's cute. I think it's cute. Although I do wish I had a better design, uh, you know, eye for design, so that I could add more details and stuff. You know. Um. In terms of like, I don't know, like, like, I guess, like, s certain stitching and seams and things like that, or like, maybe more pockets, I don't know, I don't know. Um, no, I like simple designs though, because, I, I mean, that's, that's part of the, the thing that I love about, um, my mama, Ma Mashiroshiki-san's art. And her designs is that a lot of it is very, like, simple, it's not like over-designed. Um, I kind of just want to be like a normal person, you know. <laughs> I I just want to be a normal a normal person. I don't want to have like a um. What's even the, the word? Like, I don't want to have like you know a figure skating outfit or whatever or like a big gown. I mean, <laughs> normal like normal clothes, you know, kind of casual clothes. That's what I like. And that's why I like. I don't want to overdress. More casual. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you don't want Memenchi levels of character design. Oh, Orla's mom. Yeah, no. I. <laughs> I mean, it is gorgeous. It is gorgeous. But I like. I kind of like having the casual, you know, vibes. Cause why would I be dressed up in a big, you know? I mean, maybe down somewhere down the line we could have one outfit that's like that, you know? But. Magical girl Ami stuff from the punishment game. Oh yeah, I have to finish that costume. We were, we will do a um magical girl um games stream at some point, and then I'll make sure I have a costume finished for that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like the casual. I like the casual. Um. Loungewear outfits are the greatest. I mean, that's how I feel in general about wearing clothes. I really prefer loungewear, but I think I think most people are like that. I don't think anyone's sitting at home in like a in like a like a dress shirt and like a a business suit, you know. What are you guys? Oh, never mind. Maybe I shouldn't ask that. <laughs> I was gonna ask what you guys are wearing, <laughs> but it kind of sounds like a weird question. Just like on. Uh, Isolated like that. <laughs> so what are you wearing? <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. The big shirt and nothing else costume? I mean, that's kind of what this is. <laughs> Don't actually tell me. Don't actually tell me. <laughs> Don't actually tell me. That's a weird question to ask. I wonder how many are wearing the Ami hoodie right now. <gasps> Is anyone wearing the Ami hoodie? Is there... Is this... <laughs> I forget it, forget it, forget it, forget I asked, forget I asked. <laughs> Don't tell me. <laughs> it's kind of... Yeah, it is pretty warm, huh? In, 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 uh, in, uh... In summer, you're not really gonna be wearing a hoodie. Oh my god, you're still wearing your work clothes, eh? Hoodie is hibernating. <laughs> She's curious. Hold that over her head forever. Why? What's to hold over my head? I just want to know what kind of loungewear you guys enjoy. Okay. Forget what I. Forget me asking. What are you wearing right now? I want to know what you. What's your favorite thing to wear when you're at home, just chilling? <laughs> Excuse me. Hi, Captain Price. It's very warm and rainy. It's actually rainy. Where I am as well. It was thundering earlier. Pajamas? Well, what kind of pajamas? <laughs> Use it as 
something to hold sometimes? Wait, what do you mean something to hold? The hoodie. Boxes and a t-shirt, nice and comfy. What is a diff... Never mind. Depends on the weather. Let's say right now, summer, you know. Short pants, you plead the fifth. Well, okay, plead the, the fifth if you must. A purple hoodie and gym shorts. But it's not my purple hoodie. Or is it? <laughs> pants with a fully fastened belt, a button down, and fully laced shoes. You're full of it. You're full of... Beans. Some of you guys are full of old bananas. <laughs> Shirt, sweats, and a robe is maximum comfy. Oh, that's a lot of layers. Ah, uh, you wear the Ami hoodie as loungewear. Thank you. I, I, I do as well since you know I'm not gonna wear it out in the public. Uh, a cotton tee and some gym shorts. Gym shorts? That's a popular choice. Ami streams are a formal attire. I'm not even in formal attire. <laughs> Waterproof lab coat and a bow tie, but you're a fish. But you're a fish. You shouldn't be wearing anything. I don't make the rules. <laughs> I keep gym shorts on hand if I need to answer the door and whatnot. Oh, me too, actually. Cause... Cause there's nothing worse than like... A delivery or something coming and then you have to like... You know. What? <laughs> what? What did they say? And then you have to like rush around to find pants to put on. Comfiest life, I wish 90% of my wardrobe was gym shorts and pajamas. <laughs> Why not? Why not? How is Ami a fish? She is a spider. No one said I was a fish. We're saying fish is a fish. <laughs> You wear full plate armor for what purpose? Yeah, that's never happened to me, of course, because I'm always wearing pants. And I would never, uh, you know. I don't know. That's a lie. I shouldn't even. I shouldn't tell lies. <laughs> I shouldn't tell lies. Well, I'm wearing shorts right now. Does that count? Are shorts pants? I'm wearing a big, 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 giant t-shirt and shorts right now. They're short pants. Hmm. <laughs> Sun philosophical question. If a shorts... If your shorts fall down in the forest and no one's there to see it, are you embarrassed? Oh, by the way, I said your guys' embarrassing stories were, were cute and funny and adorable. Um, but then I got some, like, ones that were... were sad, you know. So... Let me just say they were not all funny and ad precious and adorable. Some of them made me want to give you guys a hug. I'll just say that. Some people are not very nice to you guys and I don't like that and I want to beat them up. Or wait, no, I'm your mom. I shouldn't beat them up. I'm gonna call their mom. Also, they were like children when these stories happened. So I'm gonna call their mom and I'm gonna say... You need to raise your child correctly. You need to raise your child correctly. Do not... Uh... What would I say? That, that's basically all I would say. I just tell them to raise their child correctly. Do you guys know this friend? My mother and your mother were hanging out close. My mother punched your mother right in the nose. What color was the blood? <laughs> you know the little rhyme? I don't know what the purpose of it is. My mom can beat up your mom. I probably can't beat up their mom, but what I can do is... You don't know? <laughs> but what I can do is... I can... Bite them and poison them. <laughs> I mean, is the only VTuber I know who actually calls fish out for being a fish? What's wrong with that? They're always going blah blah blah. <laughs> I thought it was like a roleplay thing. <laughs> you have some wacky kids in Ami play. Okay, let me Google this. My mother and your mother are hanging 
up close. My mother and your mother were hanging up close. My mother punched your mother right in the nose. What color was the blood? I thought Amitoxin wasn't poisonous. It's not poisonous, but it is highly um, delicious and sought after to buckles. Uh, see you, Kato. But to my enemies, which is this other person's mom. The answer is, um. Yeah, what is the answer to the blood question? Is there a stronger amitoxin? It depends on... Okay, I'm about to make up some lore right now. <laughs> it depends on... If it comes from my teeth... It is highly concentrated. But any other kind of, you know... Comes from anywhere else is not as highly concentrated. If it's like if it's like you know saliva or whatever, it's not as highly concentrated. Um. Okay. Upon reaching the word, if it comes from my eyes, then it's tears. But there's like a little bit of amitoxin there. It's a little, 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 tiny, tiny, little bit. Um. You know, just various, yeah. You know, tears, saliva, stuff like that. Um, upon reaching the word blood, the child selected would call out a color and the speaker would spell it out. Whoever happened to be pointed at when the spelling was finished was it. Stuff stuff like that. Spire Girl Anatomy is such a rich and complex topic. No, it's not. Stop. Don't think about it. Just trace amounts of amitox in your hair as well. Uh, maybe in like the oils that protect my hair, but probably not from my hair itself. Yeah, so you go, my mother and your mother were hanging up close. My mother punched your mother right in the nose. What color was the blood? And then you say, orange. And then you say, O-R-A-N-G-E. And that spells orange. And you are it. And then whoever, whoever. Uh, O-R-A-N-G-E. That spells orange. And you are it. I think that's it. Okay, well, think about it, but don't talk about it. So much to relearn. Yeah, how are we gonna fill up the library again? <laughs> oh no, you're it! Have you heard this before? I don't know. Have you? This is some boomer playground, you know. This is some elaborate playground etiquette. Yeah, it's quite... So it says, unlike eeny, meeny, miny, mo, and one potato, two potato, which could have numerous variations depending on who is speaking it, this rhyme is preferred in my childhood due to the unchanging nature of the verse, as well as the pseudo-randomness caused by the color given. Besides, what boy can resist the imagery of two mothers duking it out? Pam, 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 pam. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Ding 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 This is me beating up the other kid's mom. Do you believe? Do you believe I could do it? <laughs> mama said, Mama said, knock you out. <laughs> Don't get angry. Why are you angry at me? I'm not beating up you guys, I'm beating up your enemy's mom. <laughs> Just kidding. Violence is not good. Violence is not okay. Why are you throwing punches, but you sound like you're firing off rockets? Um, I'm just not very good at sound effects is all. Yeah, I protect. Sometimes violence is okay. No, it's not. Uh, no. <laughs> Can you be at my teachers if they give me bad grades? Uh, no, if you get bad grades, I'm gonna... Not beat you up, because that wouldn't be a very nice thing to do to your child. <laughs> 
<laughs> I I would I would um give you a mental lashing. Yeah. No, I wouldn't. That's also mean. I would try and identify the issue that is causing you to not be able to concentrate because it's probably not that you're just dumb, right? It's probably there's some other thing going on. That something underlying that we gotta take care of. Can I beat you up as a buckle? Not as... Well, if you're a buckle though, you are my child. <laughs> don't use the... There's no whip. Don't be... Don't be weird. Don't be weird. Uh... We miss our mom at school. Can we be homeschooled instead? Okay! Uh, yeah, let's just do that then. You guys can... Yeah, I'll just teach you from home and then... What... What, what, what kind of subjects are we gonna learn? Because I think you can just, I think that's how it works, right? I can just decide... Like, I don't have to teach you math and stuff. We can just decide on the curriculum together. <laughs> One of them is retro games, of course. Cooking, we can do cooking. No Spire Girl Anatomy, no, that's not necessary. Uh, Nano Loop? Okay, yeah, we can do that, we can do that. Can we still see substitute teacher Ami at home too, though? Of course. In class, they're about to teach us about. No, they weren't! <laughs> Spider Girl Biology? Well, I think that's just like human bi biology. Homeschool does have to meet certain state mandated requirements though. Oh, but we're on Ami Planet, so that doesn't matter. Geography of Planet Ami. Okay, how to hack your 3DS? Yeah, I can teach you how to make potions with stuff from your own backyard. Yeah. Where do the legs come out of? Um, there's a picture. Exemplifying, demonstrating that. They come out of my back. My skin. Do my spire legs have bones? No, they have an exoskeleton. I can teach you mushroom foraging. We can... We can learn about... You never released the full res, res version, did you? No! No, I didn't. <laughs> and I never will. <laughs> Costume making, yeah. Oh, I know how to fix holes in shirts. It's called... Uh, yeah, I can teach you guys home ex sewing. Um... Um... It's called darning when you want to repair a hole like that. Did you have five morels? Morels are very, very easy to find. Well, they're very easy to identify. Never. Never. I only showed you guys that. Uh, I don't even remember. I was gonna say it was a punishment, but I think I just did it as a as a reward. <laughs> I can make holes in shirts get smaller or bigger. Yes, I can also. Teach you how to distress a t-shirt in a fashionable way. That's sewing. I was just yelling darn at my shirts and needless to say I haven't fixed any holes that way. <laughs> they're pretty rare in your area. Yeah, they're kind of rare. I think you have to like go after like fresh, 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 fresh rain. Next silent library idea. Wait, what? Oh, showing the full res... You don't need it. You don't need that. You don't need the full res version. You don't need it. It's not that much different. It's just... I mean, it's just a little sketch, little doodle. Uh, you know, it's not like... It's not like you're gonna get any more detail out of it than if you just took a screenshot from, from, from when I showed it on stream. It's important it's a reference, and you have it. And you have that reference to look at. <laughs> Stink pigs. Stink pigs every single one of us. <laughs> Meow, meow. I need my references to be as high detail as possible. There's no more detail. You guys gotta use you guys gotta use some kind of upscaling thing if you if you want if you want. I don't know. Someday. Okay, whatever. <laughs> okay, whatever. Someday maybe. Actually, I don't know if, um... I don't know if I'm actually supposed to, but I guess I already showed it, so it's fine. Yeah. It's fine. 
But no, that means you just have the full resolution version and it's just out there. I don't know if I want... I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, it's definitely fine to show. It's definitely fine to show. Um... Oh my god, I still have this, like, kids' nursery rhymes open. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by yourself. If you have a little... Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Please show. We love to see your showable things. I already showed it! I already showed it. You guys will have to do the work and then go back into the archives, into the stream archives, and find it if you want to see. Oink, stink. What? <laughs> I don't remember that one, Turbo. <laughs> It was... I don't remember what VOD it is. I guess you'll just have to watch them all. <laughs> guess you just have to watch all of my VODs. Need the fluffy spider legs. You have that. Stop... You're pressuring me. <laughs> That'll take forever. Well... There are a lot. There are a lot. <laughs> There are a lot, actually, but I'm pretty sure some people are taking up that challenge. Uh... Let's see. Can I see how many videos I have? 600! Wait! I have 600 exactly! Wait! This is an awesome milestone! I have 600 videos on my channel. That's like a lot. Happy 600! I don't think I've ever done 600 of anything in my life. No, that's not true. <laughs> I've learned 600 kanji. I've, uh... Should we celebrate? I don't know if that's celebration worthy, though. 600, I definitely drank... I definitely meowed 600 times. Well, outside of the bath... Wait, what do you mean? I definitely peed way more than 600 times, if that's what you're... If that's the implication. <laughs> way more. <laughs> More like in a week. <laughs> pizza party? Oh! We got pizza. On, um... Maybe on Friday. I don't know, maybe I want pizza. Been a couple weeks since Sappy Drunk Ami came out. A couple weeks? That's not long enough. <laughs> Cake for Galaxy Quest. Maybe. It'll be my cheat day after all. Gotta calculate the average breaks per stream. I think it's like one. I'm gonna say one. <laughs> Forget about all those streams where I definitely took like five plus breaks. I'm sorry. But you know, this is the ideal. Well, singing, maybe this is the ideal job for me to be such a. Uh, the record is. Like six? Is it six or is it like six? Do you know the exact number or do you just know an approximate number? I need to know. I need to know. <laughs> um, what was I thinking? Um, um... Oh yeah, I was gonna say it's better than a... Like a regular job. Because I can just go to the bathroom whenever I want. But at my last job, I could also just go to the bathroom whenever I want. And I just like, you know, sit on the toilet for ages. Because... Um... I just want to like look at my phone or whatever and not work. Or I didn't have work to do and I just wanted to, um... Like... Not... Not do work at my desk. I wanted to not do work on the toilet instead of... Because I would like finish all my work really fast. More than 600 if you add the few on archive. Oh, there's not that many though. Just a couple karaoke ones. The only other job you can do that is if you're a marathon bike. <laughs> if I'm bored at work, I just go yell at engineers about Spider-Man. Why about Spider-Man? Will stream 666 be super extra spooky? If I can remember... Boss makes a dollar, I make a dime. That's why I poop on company time. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Feel self-conscious that you're not working in public space. Even if... Even if, like... You've done all your work for the day, you know. Like... 
<laughs> no, I agree with that. I agree with that. Um, even if you've done all your work and there's like literally, no literally nothing more for you to do, it feels kind of bad to just be sitting around and doing nothing and like maybe doodling. So just go to the bathroom. <laughs> But yeah, I mean, if 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 it's like, here's my advice. If you're thinking like, oh, maybe I can, uh, you know, never mind. I streamed during my work hours and I got promoted this year. Oh, congratulations! I did that. <laughs> that thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> you're welcome. At this rate, six hundred sixty-six will be somewhere in September. What if I... What if I... Uh, what if I really amp it up? Hello, Mr. Mutant. Ami streams during my... Work. Solution. Listen to Ami at work. That's a good solution. Just don't get in trouble. Don't get fired. All in a day's work. Big work skills. Learn to do your work with enough time. It lasts the whole day. But it's a very little quick thing. I don't want to do that. <laughs> yeah, I think it's literally impossible for me to amp it up. And also, you guys will get sick of me. You guys will get sick of me. Oh, someone thinks you have stomach issues because you spend so much time on the bathroom. I do have stomach issues. So, you know. It's fine. <laughs> do three, three streams a day... per week? No, that's way too much. I think I would die. Not that I don't want to hang out with you guys, but I think my throat would die before anything else. <laughs> Well, I would never get sick of you guys either, so there. So, huh? You have the same glasses? Oh, these are based off my real glasses, actually. Pink kind of plastic with gold accents. I love them. Three one-hour long streams. Oh, that'd be so sad, though. You can barely even get into, the, you know... You can barely even get into, like, the... The... Sometimes, if a stream goes on... For a while, we start getting loopy on me. I think that's what we need. And if I took breaks in between each hour, I don't know if I would get as loopy. Sometimes I get very loopy. And it's very fun. Three one-hour long streams back to back just to pack the number. Okay, next next waiting room, guys. <laughs> time to go to the time time to go to the next waiting room. Same game. You do enjoy loopy on me. I'm loopy when I'm... I'm loopy when I'm... All... All game and no... I don't know. I don't know. Right now I'm not loopy. I'm just empty head. See you in the next week. <laughs> you can be in a, as unhinged as you want. No, I cannot. Trust me. Trust me. You... You will not be able to handle me at my full... At my full unhinged. I even still have limiters on to this... Day. I'm wearing weighted, uh, I'm wearing weighted clothing, weighted armor. <laughs> Luffy Ami is lots of fun, but usually it means I'm like going crazy because I played a difficult, difficult game, you know. Okay, Rock Lee, um, actually, um, I was being, uh, Piccolo. Yeah, my arm warmers are weighted. <laughs> the gold glasses bridge is my limiter. No, because I don't wear those all the time. Resident Evil. What about Resident Evil? I'm all using... Not even half. I'm using a quarter of my power. You guys went... Oh! Here's an idea I had. Speaking of not being able to handle me. <laughs> yeah! I was thinking I would... I would buzz out the ASMR mic at some point. And record... Uh, um... You know, me speaking in one of your ears. And then I would record me speaking in the other ear. And then I would put them together. So it's like I'm talking to you twice at once. It's like there's two of me. <laughs> Starfall, thank you so much for this super sticker. Thank you. Uh, you have several buckles hanging off your limbs at all times. Do I? Oh yeah, there you guys are. <laughs> <laughs> Left on me or right on me? Who do I pluck ice for? I don't know, but they're both gonna get very upset at you. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. Ami's evil twin, she plays Apex. My evil twin is TDMA and she does not play Apex. <laughs> That's a lot of Ami. I know, I know. Will you be able to handle it? I don't think so. 
Attempting to prove to chat why two Amis is too much to handle. I'll prove it. I played. I didn't play Apex on stream though. But yeah, I, I did play. I did play a little bit of Apex at a point. Uh. So, yeah, they're both. They're both demanding your. Both Amis are there, and they're both demanding your full attention. What do you do? <laughs> do you kill one of them? Don't. Don't kill one of me. <laughs> If there's two of me, you're forbidden to murder one of me. Only I can do that. <laughs> Sorry, Ami, but I like Ami more. Ah! Ami versus CDI Ami? Mm, we can't do that. That's too... That's too... Too real. <laughs> too real. It's back to mom versus mom again. Yeah, I'll be, I'll be in both of your ears being like... My mother and your mother were hanging out close. My mother punched you. And you'll just hear both Ami saying it at once. <laughs> I put in a JD picture of two Amis on the screen to make it more immersive. Oh, yeah! Can I find that? I forgot about that. It'll be like... It'll be like... Hold on, hold on, hold on. It's gonna be like... It's gonna be like... It's gonna be like... It's gonna be like... Hold on. <laughs> I gotta find it! It's going to be like... <laughs> Have I gone too far? Have I gone too far? Where is it? Where the heck is it? Thank you guys for making me so much awesome art that I'm having such a hard time finding this. You guys are the best. I love your art. Um. Um... I don't know how long ago it was. It was after my second outfit, so it's after all the outfit guesses. No, I'm not gonna get too shy to put it up. Okay, just watch. Just watch. I have the power. Um... I found it! Oh my god, I scared myself. <laughs> oh. Oh, I forgot! No, I think I can't show it actually, because I think YouTube is not gonna let me, because I forgot that I'm wearing like a. <laughs> I'm wearing a shirt in it that's, you know, it's kind of. Yeah, bye. You can't show it, I think. Yeah. On YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Give me a second, give me a second, I'll show it. Meow, 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 meow. It's not actually, it's not actually. It's appropriate. It's gonna be like this. <laughs> it's gonna be this, this, these, 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 these vibes. Two Amis, two Amis in your ear. Well, this stream turned out to be half Zatsu and half making music. So I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry it wasn't full music stream. Yeah, the background. The background is nice too. The webs and then there's a little, uh, the little, you know. The little, uh, the buckle here. I already showed you guys this a bazillion times, but I want to always show you. Many times, cause it's so freaking precious. The way my mama put a little buckle into my outfit for me. I can be your angle or your devil, but mostly your angle. Wow, I look so nerdy in this little close up. I love it. <laughs> you look good. Tiny heart buckle, tiny heart buckle. <laughs> so that's what's in the background of that picture. Meow meow meow. Meow meow meow. Meow 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 meow. Hi Cyber Sleeper. It's okay. It was an entertaining stream. I'm I'm glad you guys still have fun. Um. 
I guess a lesson to myself to make sure. Maybe I will watch like a video before trying to learn software on stream for the first time next time. <laughs> I think that'll help the situation. Um, but I still had fun. I still had fun even though I got frustrated. Even though at some point someone asked me if I have fun and I was like, uh, I was having fun, of course. I'm having fun just hanging out with you guys. But it's just a matter of, you know, I just, I just, sometimes I get stuck in this loop where I'm like, or I'm like, oh, they're not having fun. You know, sometimes sometimes my, my bad brain says that to me. Gotta min-max the fun. Yeah. I try. I try. <laughs> the brain worms say that to me. They're like, they're not having fun. They're not having fun. This is boring. This is lame. And then I'm like, then that causes to me to me to not have fun, you know, but But then once I ask you guys and you guys are like, I'm having fun, then then I feel fine. You can overthink these things. I overthink everything. I am... I am the master of overthinking. I've gotten really good at not, like... I've gotten very good at, like, recognizing when I'm overthinking. So I can't, like, deal with it usually, but I do it a lot. It doesn't always have to be fun. Chill is sometimes good, too. Yeah. Yeah. We like to chill. We like to chill. Have a little bit of a chat. It's been a while since I, um... I kind of just did a lot of chatting like this. Do you overthink your overthinking your... Over yeah. I do. <laughs> it's hard to not overthink things. Yeah. Because you think the more you think about something, then the better understanding you'll have of it. But sometimes it just... Sometimes you've already come to the max amount of understanding you can have about any given subject. And, um... You know. Stopping it or doing something else. That is hard. It is. It is. Sometimes you already thought the maximum amount you can think about a subject about and you just need to be like, okay, just let me just put it down. Just put it down. You're just gonna make yourself crazy. Uh brains can suck. It can. Being too self-aware is definitely a thing. Yeah, I think it's like I think it's like I kind of like had to be very self-aware and overthink things. So now, now that even though now that I don't really have to, I I do it kind of as a force of habit, you know. Like I mean, when I was younger and stuff. No thoughts besides I'm cute. It's easy to be a buckle. Don't listen to your brain. Only listen to. Don't listen to your brain at night. Is the, is the lesson. <laughs> You can always ask us to reassure you it's never a problem. Yeah, I know. I know you guys are happy to do that, but it's not... That's not your guys' responsibility to, like... You know... Bring me out of my bad brain, you know? That's something I gotta deal with. But sometimes I still do, and I appreciate that you guys let me do that. Buckles listen to Ami. Ami listens to Buckles. Yeah! Listen to your spider mama. You're a night owl. I used to be a freaking night owl. Actually, I'm even, like... Kind of... My sleep schedule is so messed up now. Again. Because I end up waking up really, really early in the morning and then going back to sleep. And I don't know why. I don't know what's causing it. Um... Some of you guys are super, super night owls. I'll wake up and you guys will still be like responding to me on Twitter. And I'm like, either... You haven't slept at all. Or you slept a very small amount. <laughs> Waking up too cozy? No, sleeping is the cozy part. Waking up is the lame part. It's an alien embryo in your brain. You think they put one there? Three hours is enough? You guys are crazy. Three hours is not enough. <laughs> if you only get three hours of sleep a night, you're gonna get... You're gonna make yourself... Your brain's gonna go loopy. Sleep is for people who have their meow together. I used to... <laughs> I don't know what's happening. I try to fix this so much. I really don't like, uh, you know... Going to sleep and waking up... Uh, early and then going to sleep again. It's really not good. For your circadian rhythm or whatever. Can't remember when I last went to bed before 3am. It's a bit of a problem, I suppose. Oh, sorry! Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> for bumping you guys. <laughs> um, Five to six hours. I would say that's on the low end, but it's, it's enough. It's enough. <clears throat> um, you know what? I'm probably I might be a 
up like watching videos till around that time because I watch videos to get to sleep. But I don't know. <coughs> I used to be able to sleep through the night as a kid. I miss those days. I was never able to sleep through the night. Because... 12 hours? Mm, I think that's a lot, but... I don't think it's a problem if you have that much time to sleep. I can never sleep all the way through the night. Because at some point, inevitably... Because I'm well hydrated, you know? If I sleep late a few nights in a row, I end up sleeping in at some point. But if it's only once, I feel fine the next day. I sleep late a few nights... Oh, you mean like if you stay up too late too much. And then... Then it messes up your, your waking up the next morning. But if you just do it once, you can wake up at a normal time. I have an awful habit of drinking coffee at night. I used to do that and then I started drinking decaf at night. But now I'm back to drinking regular coffee at night because... Last time I got decaf from the t the t the t I'll just say it. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. From from the... The... The, the Timmy Hortz. It was all... T burnt tasting. It tasted burnt. If you watch videos to sleep due to nightmares... Uh, no, not not because of nightmares. I just, you know... Yeah, it was burnt tasting. Uh. Uh. Uh, yeah, Timmy Horse is global. It's global. The Tim's by US terrible coffee. I mean, they're all kind of terrible coffee, to be honest. It's all... It's kind of like not... Kind of like a separate experience from coffee, you know? Like, 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 if I'm getting coffee from there, it's because I want a very specific experience. It's not because I want to drink coffee. You know what I mean? <laughs> Tim Hortons, never seen one in the US. There's, there's lots of Tim Hortons in the US. It's a cup of dough. In the evening, I switch coffee with. I thought that said Bailey. <laughs> I was like, dang, okay, are you going to drink like that? <laughs> Instead of coffee, I'll just drink some Baileys. No, barley, like barley tea, I think you mean. <laughs> There's a local brand that's sold in supermarkets and tastes real good. You just gotta try new brands until you find the one. Oh, of coffee? Yeah, no, I, I like uh, coffee that I make. Just fine, yeah. I have a, I have a, uh, like a Keurig. And I have a little, um... Reusable cup for it. I can just put my own coffee in. There are quite a few in the northeast now. Yeah, exactly. They're all over the place. Uh, you start selling Ami brand of coffee. What would that taste like? Shoro cookie flavored coffee. Have you guys ever had a flavored coffee like that? Tim Hortons is an invasive species. Wow. <laughs> That's harsh. I got pretty good with the espresso. No, I don't have an espresso machine. I don't have that, sadly. I want it to taste like sugar cookies. Can we can we make that happen? Rather than having my own coffee, I want to have my own creamer. That my own flavored creamer. Proper pour over with a kettle tastes even better, but not everyone wants to spend the time. Oh, I like uh, French press coffee too, but the curing is so much easier. Sometimes I have French vanilla coffee. Mmm. Have you ever had... Now, I don't drink sugar anymore, so I don't do this anymore. But have you ever had... From Tim Hortons... Coffee... Mixed... With... Um... Half coffee, half... French vanilla. <laughs> Pretty good. Hello, oh, what's happening? Windows Defender, go away. Yeah. How's my day going? My my day go my day going pretty my day was uh, ah! <laughs> My day pretty going good. <laughs> my day going much better now that I'm just like chatting and hanging out. What about civet coffee? Is that the one with the with the bats? The bats do the thing. I can't read. I know read good. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, it is that one. <laughs> oh, Sarah, thank you so much for the super chat. I appreciate that. It is that one. No, no. No. <laughs> I don't like that. I don't like it. No, 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 no. I don't want that. The events are like monkey. Wait, it's a monkey? I thought it was bats. I mean, no, I can't do Zatsu dance. Also, I mean, Zatsu is for 80 minutes like it's nothing. I mean, I can, but the question is, is it entertaining or is it cringe? <laughs> uh, I know, I know what Civic Coffee is. I know what it is. I don't want to know. There's some kind of cat-like animal. Oh, wait, really? Whoa! That's not a bat! <laughs> what? <laughs> What the heck is this thing? It's so cute! Oh! Look! Oh! <laughs> Baby! Baby! Yes, oh, look at its tail! Its tail is like a cone shape. Look at this little creature! I love it! You guys don't think it's cute? It's a monkey! It's not a monkey. <laughs> it looks kind of like a lemur mixed with a cat, mixed with a ferret, mixed with a raccoon, mixed with my cat, mixed with Kitty R. <laughs> so sad that you won't drink this coffee? No! He doesn't care. He wishes I didn't. <laughs> Not drink the coffee cube, but still, you know what? No, it's not. <laughs> Civet with a V, with a V. No, it's not AIR, it's a real animal. It's a real animal. It has a little mohawk, kind of. It's like a natural mohawk. Do you guys want to see something really cute? Wait, no, it's not cute. It's like... Mind-blowing. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Wait, where is it? This is the wrong one. <laughs> that's 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 me when I can't make music with the nano. <laughs> Monkey. <laughs> 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 it's broken for sure. <laughs> Same series. <laughs> I love monkeys doing human things. <laughs> oh my god, my face hurts. There's a dog slamming a keyboard? No, we're gonna find that next. <laughs> he looks so upset. He's like, he got some terrible news. <laughs> Dog slamming keyboard. Is he playing a game? Is it a Shiba? <laughs> Does he have angry eyebrows? But I tell the monkey, I told him. No, I'm, no, I mean, toxin left. I'm all dry. That's what I told him. And the pizza place doesn't deliver to your location. Uh, okay. A Shiba in a red shirt. Okay, yeah, it's this one, this one, this one. Guys, it's not real. I was just being a monkey. I mean, not the monkey. What was I doing? I was just pretending for the monkey. <laughs> there it is! Okay. <laughs> Why is he doing that? 
This is not real. This is sped up, right? <laughs> He's upset because the game went away. Why is he so upset? Yeah, he wants it back. He was like, I'm watching that. I was playing that, he said. <laughs> <laughs> I've truly become an old lady with like just like just like dying laughing at these freaking <laughs> dying laughing at these like America's funniest home video tier animal video. <laughs> That's me with Nami Bot ends all. It's King of You guys recognize what fighter it was? You guys are sick. You guys are sick in the head. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh... Oh. Uh... Buckles plot elaborate Ami talks in depth by distracting Ami with cute animal gifts. You could do it. You could do it. I'm uh, extremely, extremely susceptible to cute animal... ...gifts and videos and just animals being silly. I love... I love them all. Okay... I should go, <laughs> I suppose, and eat. Mm, I feel shy now. I talked too long. It was okay. You guys. Eating stream. Oh. On Friday, I will eat with you guys. During the movie. Yeah, you can have a hug. There you go. On Friday, I will eat with you guys. You can have like... like Pizza or something together. Yeah. Pizza or something. Something like that. Okay, you guys. Okay. Why do I get all self-conscious? Why? <laughs> I hate it. I hate it. But thank you guys for hanging out anyway. Thank you for... Thank you for... For, uh... Uh... You know, putting up with all this scuff with the software earlier. And still having... And still sticking around. And still having a good time with me chatting. I appreciate you guys so much. Um... I, um... I... I... I will see you guys... Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow is double stream day. We have fishing and we have some asthma. I think we're just gonna do a tea time, but we're gonna do it at night. I think, I think, because we haven't done tea time in a long time. I like it. I want to whisk your guys' brain. I wanna, I wanna, I want to, um, you know, I don't go and turn your brain into liquid. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do for ASMR this week, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, you guys. Thank you very much for coming. Thank you to all my regulars and irregulars and everyone who stopped by for the first time. Appreciate you giving me a chance. Thank you so much to all of the VOD watchers and VOD commenters and the chatters and lurkers. And thank you very much to all my dream weavers, buckles, spiderlings, and everybody who donated and renewed their memberships and joined the membership this stream. Your support is super, super helpful to me. And I will see you tomorrow for double stream day. Comfy, 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 comfy. Okay. Okay. Oscar is a mia. Oh, yes, Bye bye.